yesterday the governor said we have political contractors who would just uh, you know go to abuja and then meet politicians and they're not even contractors in the actual sense but then some of these projects are given to compensate them lots of accusations he made one of them it's it's not the first time some time ago uh when he received the uh, um, senate committee on Nanja delta uh, here in port Harcourt, he said that the ndc has been hijacked by political actors using the commission for their selfish interest. This was the accusation he made. He said the National Development Commission uh, was plotting to oust him from his position as governor of River State. I want to quote him now, yes. uh, word for word. Uh, what NDDC does through the supervision of their party is to make sure they vote out some money to ensure certain governors do not return. You can imagine NDDC wasting $10 billion to remove me here. Is the money not wasted now? NDDC wasted 10 billion naira to remove just one governor. Now, this was what the governor said yes. uh, uh, at the time he had his visitors. Yes. Uh, uh, so he keeps saying things like this. But then there was a time where um, he wasn't in the situation that he is now, where in the state is in opposition. It's, it's, it's so, so does that mean, can we then safely say that? It, it could also be part of the problem. Now, it's, it's even where I want to address very significantly, which is part of the reasons we, the people, are being the ones that are being cheated here. Um, uh, Governor Yosemite, His Excellency, as a matter of fact, was part and parcel of the federal government in, during the last two administrations. And if you look at it very well, which is the more reason everybody, all of us must collectively agree with the positions which has been rightly posited by the governor. Because mm. he has a primary knowledge. He is speaking from first-hand information, having functioned at the level of the federal government. But the question is, why are all these things being reviewed at the expiration of your time? When you now feel that ah, the opportunity for you to address that issue is no longer in your hands. That is the only time you will speak up. And that is what exactly is playing out in virtually all the sectors of both the state and the federal government. Once you leave the position, the people give you that oppor opportunity for you to represent them very well. You will have the opportunity to seize it perfectly. But within the period you are within that confine of that office, you will not be able to achieve anything. Once that power is taken away from you and you feel that another person is enjoying the same thing you enjoyed during your administration, that is the only time you are coming out to tell Nigerians that, ah, there is a lacuna somewhere. But in all, in all sincerity, in all sincerity, having partook or having partaken in the past two administration that just concluded, Yeso Mike has a very good point. That, yes, it is part of the industry of NDDC to collude with the federal government, to agree with them on how to map out fund. Of course, you look at it. If you even want to appreciate this thing very well, what is the purpose of this creation of NDDC, as a, as a matter of fact? Have you looked at it? If you look at it, and then put it vis-a-vis -vis the achievement of the Niger NDDC mm. in the Niger data. Can it be commensurate with the amount of money that has been allocated to them from the establishment of this NDDC in 2008? The answer is no. The amount of money that has been allocated to NDDC, if you look at it, it has no reflection in any of the nine states of the NDDC. What is the reason? Because the appointer at the moment of appointing, you look at the way they lobby for the appointment. A friend of mine recently called me and said, ah, I intend to secure an appointment in NDDC. And this is what they are asking me to bring. So after bringing that kind of money, you will think that the person will just go there and sit and watch. And then will not have the opportunity to appropriate certain public funds to himself. Because from the appointment, the foundation is corrupt. So if we must get it well, we must uproot it from the basic foundation. Because the man who has the ability to appoint is even looking for a way to siphon the people. So once you siphon, the person who is coming to represent goes there as a mere common flash. Does not represent the interests of the people, which ordinarily should be the okay. major purpose of it.